Yeah, no, I thought uh, I thought we played close to a 60-minute game. I thought we came out hard, uh, dictated a play for the most part in the first period, and I thought it carried over. Problem was we didn't get our first goal. We didn't get the first goal, and I thought if we could have just got that first goal and give us a little, a little momentum, uh, we'd be on our way. But a uh, uh, lot different than last night, the feeling as far as how we played. And, uh, again, I think you play that way uh, for a 60-minute game. Normally you'll get the result, but tonight we didn't. Yeah, they did. You know, they, you know, they, they packed it in there a little bit. We we had some hard, heavy shots, some rockets that uh, that, they, that they blocked, and we had a barrage in the third period. I think they had four or five in, in a row. They they blocked, but you know, it, it, you got to find a way to get to net, whether it's uh, off the end boards, whether it's an extra pass to the lateral pass. Uh, got to find ways to get it to the net, and you know, that's 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 a, that's a way of winning games, right? Blocking shots, and that's a that's a part of it. But we. Uh, we had a good effort tonight by everybody here, and we need to make sure that we dictate play next week when we go home. Uh, you guys have been juggling some of the lines mid-game too. Yeah, both. Yeah, yeah, and and you know what? It's one of those things you go through the game, and I thought we sustained pretty good pressure over 40 minutes. But I think you have to explore and try to try to see if you can generate a goal. You know, we scored one five-on-five five goal this weekend, and uh, and at the end of the day, uh, you know, trying to to see if it doesn't. If you don't score a goal in the first 20 minutes or 40 minutes, to see if you can generate by a, another line combination or early in the season like this. So, like I said, at the end of the day, we, we've kept some tandems together and just moved maybe wingers around a little bit. But uh, you know, just trying to find ways to score a goal. Is there anything you want to see different five on five, or did you like go out of what you saw tonight? Yeah, you know what? I, I think uh, I, I thought tonight we did a better job of keeping plays alive in the offensive zone. I thought we were harder on pucks. We we ended up possessing pucks more. We it was on our tape. We moved pucks quicker. And I think if if you get into that situation of, of trying to accomplish all those things, you're going to generate offense, which which we did tonight. You know, in a game when it's tight checking game and there's not a lot of time and space, you gotta you gotta keep things simple. And, and I think at the end of the day of just making sure that more pucks go to the net and and uh, and possessing pucks in the offensive zone. Yeah, so Caleb uh, was out for precautionary reasons tonight. You know, obviously, uh, you know, he got hit in the head with a puck there on a block shot and uh, tonight. And I would say that's pretty short term. And, and with Bennett, you know, we're getting more evaluations done right now. And I think we'll get more information next week to see see how longer term that is. Yeah, he did. And, you know, I was just commenting to the staff, I think, with all the young guys. And, you know, Jaden did a good job of moving pucks and playing physical. And I, I think not only with him, but all the young guys, the more reps you get, the more comfortable you look and confident you look. And I thought he looked confident tonight. Yeah, you know, honestly, I thought we played a better game than we did last night. Uh, we couldn't get that first one to fall, which ultimately we needed to kind of get some momentum. But it just it wasn't going our way tonight. It's frustrating. It sucks to lose our first loss of the regular season. But... You know, I, I think if we keep playing like that, we're going to get get a lot of good bounces down the road. Uh, they blocked 34 shots. So does it, did it feel like they were blocking a lot tonight? Yeah, like credit to them. They play hard defense, and we had to work really hard to get our chances. But honestly, I didn't I didn't know those 34. That's a lot, and that's something we're going to work on to keep getting pucks through, and which will let us to get more scoring chances. But but we're, we're going to work at it, and we're going to get it. Uh, the Lions have been shifting around during the first two games. What's that like as a player seeing different line mates? Yeah, I don't think it's too hard, honestly. I think we do a lot of reps throughout the week just getting to play with other guys. So I think if guys are having good games or we're trying to get other looks, we're able to do that pretty easily. And I don't think it's it's that effect. Like, it doesn't affect me that much, I don't think. What did you like about you said you uh, thought if, if some bounces go? What did you like about the way you played? Yeah, honestly, I thought, I thought we played a, a lot harder. Our, I thought we won a lot more battles than we did last night. And just overall playing harder, like I thought our intensity was there from the get-go, but we just weren't rewarded with those with the goals. Yeah, I mean, uh, all around, I thought we did a good job. Like we played how we wanted to play. Um, Bob Shallon just after last night, we didn't start out too good. The first two periods weren't our best hockey, and then you know we got the win in the third and fought back. But Tonight, you know, he challenged us to play our game, and I thought we did that for the most part. And you know, there's a couple breakdowns that we got to fix and stuff like that. But you know, we got to move past this and focus on next weekend now. I feel like it was tough to get some pucks to the net with they blocked a lot of the shots tonight. Yeah, um, they did a good job blocking shots and getting in front of lanes and stuff like that. Um, I think sometimes we just got to be a little bit more deceptive and know they're going down for shots and maybe fake push or something like that. But they did a good job tonight, and credit to them. 
Yeah, I thought a lot of guys stepped up. Um, you know, Comer, Juby, um, guys like that, you know, they really stepped up, even Daner. Like, he's a forward playing D-man out there, and he did a really good job. And, you know, I think for those guys, you know, you just got to wait for your name to be called. And, you know, they did that, and they did a good job tonight.